Hi, welcome to clickmyproject.com. I am going to explain the concept of Vanet based secure and privacy preserving navigation. Let's say start with abstract. A navigation scheme that utilizes the road information collected by a vehicular hardware network to guide the drivers to desired destinations in a real time and distributed manner. The proposed scheme has the advantage of using road conditions to compute a better route and at the same time the information source can be properly authenticated. Vanet provides facility for the vehicles on roads to communicate for driving safety. The basic idea is to allow arbitrary vehicles to broadcast ad hoc messages to other vehicles. However, this raises the issue of security and privacy. Uh, here there are various existing solutions and protocols that are used in order to satisfy the security and privacy requirement of the vehicular ad hoc network also described security issues. Also this scheme fulfills all other necessary security requirements. This is the flow diagram for uh, Panet based secure and privacy based navigation project. Initially, the source will uh, register themselves with the trusted party. Uh, after that, uh, it should uh, get the key from the trusted authority, then generate the Zuda value and uh, compute the traffic data. Then it will be transferred to the RSU unit. At the destination, the RSU will uh, get the data from the client and uh, validate the source, information, source uh, authority. If it is a uh, valid, valid client, it will be uh, transferred uh, and uh, stored in the database. Then uh, the data will be filtered by uh, updating the older traffic messages and it will be forwarded to the other vehicles. At the destination vehicle, uh, it will be logged their uh, details and uh, view the traffic data uh, to modify the route uh, location. Let's we see the demo for a vanet based secure and privacy preserving navigation project. In this project we have four process, one is uh, vehicle info, then trusted party and uh, RSU and finally uh, get traffic info process. Um, we, uh, we have to run the vehicle info first. So here uh, this will be act as a source vehicle. So to generate uh, traffic uh, information each vehicle must register with RSU and trusted party. So click on the register button and uh, here give the vehicle owner name that is where I, here I am giving vehicle 1 and the ve uh, vehicle registration number as uh, TN50234 then vehicle model as 2 below and uh, email id is vehicle1 at gmail.com then the emergency number as Then click on generate button. This login ID and uh, password will be used for further login process. Click on register button. The uh, vehicle is uh, registered successfully. Then click OK. Here we have to provide the login ID and password to generate a vehicle uh, traffic information. So uh, here I am giving the login ID value and password. To, uh, to generate a uh, traffic information here so we have to note, note down the login id and uh, password value so if then click on sign in here we have to uh, here there are the, there are some fields that is owner id vehicle number traffic location traffic uh, traveling location etc um, here we have to provide the vehicle number which we uh, provide previously. Click on get uh, pseudo ID and pseudo vehicle number ID. This is a uh, uh, vehicle uh, pseudo ID for uh, owner ID and this is vehicle number ID. So we have to note it down. So this will be used for further process. Here we have to provide the traffic location information. I am giving a Vizunaga and the traffic location as a Turuvan Mir. Then the speed of the vehicle is 45 km per hour and the traffic weight is 15 minutes. Then provide the traffic type 
whether it is an accident or a tra signal failure here i am giving an accident then click on save button the file will be the traffic uh, information will be saved then click on ok button then click next here we have to send this uh, traffic information to the uh, rsu that is our roadside unit before that we have to get the key register key value from the uh, trusted party so to get that click on get button here we have to provide the id value which we generate now round the trusted party process here to get the key click on the request key button and uh, at the trusted party click on the serve message button and uh, the vehicle id is uh, fetched before uh, the, to generate the key value we have to verify the client so the uh, it is uh, the vehicle 172 is a valid client can generate key so click the uh, key values and send this to the client vehicle save this uh, key value at the server side click ok and close this application then pass this value back to the vehicle here we have to pro uh, provide the key value then open the traffic information so click on the next button before uh, here we have to give the send button to send the traffic information to the rsu before sending this uh, we have to run the rsu process so, click on the receive traffic message at the rsu click send button at the vehicle client okay okay file is transferred then uh, now the by uh, by sending the tra traffic information the client side process is over click on view button at the rsu side the message sent from the client uh, vehicle is shown here click on the x button click the view traffic table this is the overall traffic message sent from various client various client vehicle uh, by clicking on modify traffic table it will be filtered uh, it will filter the old uh, messages old traffic messages so before that we have to choose the choose each va values and click on the modify traffic table route traffic table is modified so now we have to uh, uh, run the destination vehicle project this is the destinations you have to provide the login id value password and a key value click on sign in button the logged in successfully then uh, here the destination uh, vehicle can view the traffic information sent sent from various uh, various uh, vehicle in vehicles so uh, by click uh, by providing the individual owner id vehicle owner id it can view the it can view the particular message so here uh, i am selecting the vehicle 172 owner id it shows it shows the received message traffic information received time and the uh, traffic information details here so by this the project is over thanks for listening